All right, so my target buck, he's eluded me the last three years. Um, he was a big eight pointer, and this year he turned into a big nine. The only opportunity that I've ever had to kill him was last year at my little honey bear's birthday party, Faith. When she turned three years old, he was out there broad daylight in the bedding area. I could have smoked him. That's why we named him the honey bear buck. It's November 3rd. It's about 30 degrees, the time changed. Same deal as last year. I'm on the porch. I'm gonna go inside, grab my gear, head into the bedding area. Last year, on Faith's birthday, there was that big eight pointer there. Um, then I saw him a couple more times on trail camera throughout the year. And I ended up shooting that other uh, 12 pointer last year. Yeah. Same spot, but hopefully the big eight will show up. He's actually a nine pointer this year. I got him on trail camera earlier, um, but I haven't seen him since. So that's the buck I'm after. Uh, doing this interview on the porch though, because I'm gonna be super quiet and I'm probably not gonna be able to do an opening interview in the stand. So I'll catch you in the stand, baby. Wish me luck, peace. what same thing as last year yep right across the street yep I mean exactly almost to a T same time same day the time change is a whole nine yep just come to the house and we'll go get him awesome thanks man see ya all right guys we just got here the trails in um, changed clothes obviously we're gonna go look for the buck um, it's a special buck to me, so got Uncle Skippy filming the recovery, same as last year, same day, time change and all. So let's go get him. Heavy. Oh my gosh beautiful buck it's a very special buck to me he's got big long beams good mass too just 
just an incredible buck. It's November 3rd, high pressure morning. It's on in Kansas.